Hello and welcome back to the channel. This prophetic word comes from Kelly Ewing, Raleigh, North Carolina. Remain focused on the Lord. You are special to the Lord. He wants you to know that He truly enjoys your quiet moments together. Life can get busy at times. There are so many distractions wanting to pull us away. Remain focused on Him. There are some things that He wants to share with you. I want to encourage you today to rest in Him. To rest in the Lord. He has it all figured out. His divine plan, His master plan, and you are part of it. You will see your way through. God is leading the way. He's bringing things into alignment, so don't be discouraged. Jesus sees it and knows. He's been right there with you. He will continue to be there with you. You are coming through. New things planned, new things on the horizon. He says, trust me, for I have much more for you. Better than what you have expected. It's a new year, so we have to be hopeful. God's plans are always for our good. Let me prophesy over someone right now. You will see God move in your life in unprecedented ways. Some may even start taking little steps, but these steps will lead you into greater steps. For some, it could be reuniting with a lost friend or a family member, where forgiveness begins and healing takes place. For another, it could be step, a stepping stone into a new job placement or a promotion. I feel God is going to move in ways we did not see coming, no matter what it may look like around us. That saying, one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind comes to mind. What you walk into will have an effect on others as well. Let's pray. Father God, we know, Lord, we know that we can get our hopes up. We can be expectant. We can be hopeful, Father, when the world says it's hopeless. We can be hopeful, Father, as we rest in you. As, Lord, we rest in your plan, in your master plan, in your divine plan, Father. God, help us to be focused on you. Help my friend to remain focused on you. Lord, that we may trust you. That we may trust you for what you have for us. The plan you have. What an encouragement, Father. It's better than we've expected. Lord, we pray that we can be hopeful. We pray that we can first think of the good plans that you have for us. And Lord, may we bring someone else along on the journey for encouragement and for hope. In Jesus' mighty name, amen.